Let's talk about this picture of Alberta Premier Daniel Smith and what it means about the far right in Canada. So right-wing commentator Tucker Carlson made two speaking appearances in Alberta this week, including at an event in Calgary where he was interviewed on stage by Smith. And on the night of the event, Smith shared this image of herself and Carlson alongside noted right-wing flop and anti-pronoun crusader Jordan Peterson and right-wing media mogul Conrad Black. And let's really break down this nightmare blunt rotation and what it means about the far right in Canada for queer and trans folks specifically. First up, there's Jordan Peterson, a psychologist and former University of Toronto professor who has become somewhat of an anti-trans crusader in recent years and has refused to use the correct pronouns for trans students. He's claimed that feminists have, quote, an unconscious wish for brutal male domination and denounced identity politics, in addition to becoming a sort of ideological figurehead for a certain type of white male victimhood. Then there's Tucker Carlson, the media commentator who memorably was fired by Fox News last year. His resume includes such accolades as spreading misinformation about gender-affirming healthcare, harassing trans people, and raving against and weirdly sexualizing the green M&M. The same night before Smith joined him on stage, he also made a homophobic joke about Prime Minister Justin Trudeau. I know that in Canada it's official policy that coming out of the closet is good. Also in this picture is Conrad Black, the media mogul who founded the National Post in 1998 and has written a column for the paper ever since. In 2007, he was convicted on four counts of fraud in the U.S., and two of those, a conviction for felony fraud and obstruction of justice, were upheld in 2010. He received a sentence of 42 months in prison and a fine of $125,000, and in 2019, of course, it was then-President Donald Trump who granted him a presidential pardon. His column in the National Post tackles topics such as the attack on Christmas, criticisms of wokeism, and defenses of J.K. Rowling's anti-trans views. And then there's Danielle Smith, the Premier of Alberta. That Smith would rub shoulders with this crew isn't all that surprising, but it is a signal of what's to come for Canada's political landscape. So on social media, Smith positioned this photo and her conversation with Carlson as an openness to talk about all sorts of things with all sorts of media. But Carlson entered the conversation with a very stated goal of liberating Canada and staunch defense of the arrested Freedom Convoy protesters, alongside the rest of the far-right ideas that he's often spouted. And Smith played along. During their talk, she encouraged Carlson to put Federal Environment Minister Stephen Gobert, quote, in his crosshairs. And for a long time, Smith has tried to toe a line around social conservatism, particularly when it comes to queer and trans issues. She frequently brings up having a non-binary relative, and has been relatively more quiet on certain queer and trans issues, say, the wave of parental rights school pronoun policies, than many of her conservative premier peers. But a photo like this, and an event like this, shows just how much Canada's conservative leaders are cozying up to and endorsing some very dangerous ideas. And to be clear, we should be very worried that this is the sort of company that our political leaders are keeping. 